Charles Manson. The name itself is synonymous with evil, a killer who did no killing but whose crimes shocked the world. In August 1969, followers of his cult broke into the Hollywood home of Sharon Tate. The pregnant actress, who was married to the director Roman Polanski, was brutally murdered along with four of her friends. The next night, the so-called Manson family killed again, tying up and murdering a wealthy couple. This was the Ramshackle Ranch in Death Valley, where Manson lived in a commune with his young runaway fans. They apparently used LSD and saw the guitar-playing ex-convict as a kind of saint, or perhaps a devil. Charles Manson was charged not with wielding a knife or firing a gun, but with controlling and directing the killers. I don't accept the court. I don't accept the whole situation. You know, like I was in the desert minding my business. Uh, this confusion belongs to you. It's your confusion. I don't have any confusion. I don't have any guilt. I know what I've done, and no man can judge me. I judge me. What have you done, Charlie? And why had he done it? Apparently to spark a race war. It would be called Helter Skelter, and he would use it to seize power. In 1971, Manson was sentenced to death on seven counts of murder, later commuted to life in prison. Over the years, Charles Manson applied for parole time and time again, but he died a prisoner, having shattered the peace and love of the 1960s with diabolical violence.